<clears throat> hmm. Good night, ladies and gentlemen, it's I, Nick Storm, the Australian iconic icon. That's what they call me, uh, because that's who I am. Huh, plain and simple. Now, I, I sound like I just woke up, but that's because I, uh, I couldn't sleep knowing that I was getting this bad boy in the mail. I, I was checking my tracking app, I was making sure every damn day that uh, I wasn't gonna miss out on this delicious package that we have here. And, oh my God, let's just get right into it. Ah, I cut myself, ah, oh, just kidding. Oh my goodness, I've been waiting for this for so long. <laughs> Incredibly long. Uh, so let's just see who it is. Oh my God, it's, it's freaking beautiful. It's delicious, look at it. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Wow. Damn, baby. Damn, baby. That shit bussin'. Now, I'll give it to Magic Almost, Jazzwares, Wicked Cool Toys, and Jeremy and everyone because this figure is bussin' respectfully. Seriously, though, I'm so excited to have this figure in my collection. You have no clue. Oh, wait. Oh, we got a little pamphlet, though. <laughs> That's cool. Who gives a flying hell about the pamphlet? We are here for Kenny Omega. The best promotion. You know, cool look at the back of the box with the other people in the set. I got this Cody on the way as well as the TNT Championship Cody. Thank you. Shout out Poop Peddler. So yeah, I got this Cody on the way. This is the rest of the figures in the set. Very, very awesome and sexy. Now, I don't hate all these figures in the set, but I want to wait until like, uh, I don't know, they upgrade like a, a Sammy Guevara because I wasn't too big on that head scan. But yeah, maybe if we get a Sammy Guevara with a straight face or a straight head scan, that'd be really cool. And I would cop that instantly. So I could make him do like six thirties off of like buildings and everything. I don't know. Anyway, let's rip this bad boy open. I haven't opened up an, uh, an AEW figure in a quite a while. So, oh my God, let's get this bad boy open. What am I trying to do? Open it like, open it nicely so it doesn't break. I forgot you can't really, can't really do that anyway with this, with this packaging. Very cool. Kenny, what the frick are you looking at, man? Oh my god. Another really good thing I love about Jazzwares is just the harken back to like my old school collecting where I would just I would just rip out every figure, you know. I wouldn't care about the box and all that. I'd just rip out the goddamn figure. And I like how there's not an option to um like gently take out the uh, the the card and everything, you know what I mean? So there's like no like real good way to just take it out smoothly. So you have to rip it open. I love how it doesn't give you an option to uh, gently, you know, escort the figure out of the <laughs> out of the box. Because if they did, I probably would do that. But I, I love this sensation of ripping the box open. So yeah, I really like uh, how this looks. You know, just uh, in the packaging. Uh, is this a case defender? <laughs> Let me know down in the comments if this is a case defender. Just freaking kidding. I know it's not a case defender. What am I, stupid? Oh my goodness. Oh my glory goodness. Oh my god. My god. <laughs> no, my shooter hand is bent. I fix. I fix. Easy, easy peasy. All right, let's take a close look at Kenson. Kenneth Omega. All right, here is a closer look at the Unrivaled Series 4 Kenny Omega. Now, when I tell you that this is the end-all, be-all figures for me, I, I just think this is beautiful, like the attire and everything. I love how the attire on this has more, like, depth and detail than it does in real life. It's, it's just cool to me. The vest has the one wing. It's beautiful. It's all freaking, it's all smexy and beautiful. Look at his face. Speaking of his face, let's go about, let's go, let's go to a little bit of story time with this figure.
when this figure first initially got ah when it first initially got the pictures posted for it by like jeremy and all elite wrestling and everything like that i wasn't a i i actually hated this head scan i thought it was like a big downgrade from the series one head scan and then i, I likened up to it like so fast i i i grew to like it and uh, now I just absolutely love it. I think it's way better than the uh, Unrivaled Series 1. Speaking of which, I also have the Unrivaled Series 1B on the way. So really keen to see how that will turn out in real life in person. Also a side note, these arms are very flimsy. Like, I don't know what it is, but the other Unrivaled figures haven't been like this at all. Kind of scares me too, because I think I, it feels like I'm gonna like break the arms or something like that, which is uh, no bueno. This is his face. Wait, what the? What just came out? I think I just got possessed for a second. What was that? Here we go. This is the head scan of Kenny Omega. Beautiful. I love, I love what they've done with the hair, the, all the shading and everything. I think this is really good. Way better than that freaking ring they just wrapped around Kenny's head for the ringside exclusive uh, that came with the ring. Speaking of that attire, I would love to see that attire redone in figure form with the new updated skin tones and everything. I just love that attire. That's like one of my favorite Kenny Omega attires. So. I think that'd be really cool to see. Okay, let's take this freaking jacket off of him and get a, get, a, get a full grasp of this figure in its, all its glory. God damn, he's jacked, man. He's been, he's been hitting the weights, I'll tell you that much. And for a little bit of comparison, here is the Unrivaled Series 1 Kenny Omega. I mean, look at the height difference. What the hell? I had no clue that was like that. Damn. This is guys who are six feet versus girls who are six feet. Am I wrong? Put, me, put it down in the comments. Uh, XD LeMayo. This is cool though. I love this Kenny already. This is awesome. But the only, yeah, the only thing that scares me is this, how flimsy the arms are. Now, if we compare it to this one, oh, there's really no difference. I don't know. This one feels like it's going to break more though, but it still has that sort of effect, you know, that's really wobbly and shaky. And I believe seeing, I remember seeing Stage Creator, he had a Matt Hardy from Unrivaled 4 and that arm snapped off. Uh, like it was nobody's business, which is kind of scary, especially if you're an Australian figure collector because them Them MFers can take that long to ship here like they they get here in like three years I swear to God also if you're wondering what parts are different about the unrivaled I believe the lower torso is uh, And also if you look fun fact this Kenny Omega doesn't have a belly button and this one does I don't know just a fun little fact that I picked up on not too long ago, but Pardon me. But yeah, pretty much, I freaking love this figure, honestly. I don't know how many times I can say that in this one review that I love this figure, honestly, but probably it's been a million now, I can say. And for the hands, he does come with one bang bang, good night, mwah, good night, kissy, mwah, mwah, good night, bang hand. And then he also comes with uh, this one, which is like him doing his pose and everything with the gun shooting, mwah, mwah, kiss, good bang, mwah hand. I, I love this hand as well. I love I love the uh, the hands that come with it. I wish there was a second one of this because we always see always see Kenny like pointing them both up in the uh, in the entrance. Oh, that reminds me. Get the frick out of here, man! No one wants to see you. Yeah, baby, with that AW championship because he is the king of all championships. Hey, why do we stop there? And boom! Now our Kenny Omega is ready to be put on display with his uh, million. Uh, and millions 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 of uh, championship belts. This really takes belt collected to a whole new uh, medium, I think. Okay, Kenny, okay, don't get don't get freaking greedy, man. Let's just take all these off, man, before you get too power hungry, even though I think that's inevitable because you are inevitable, Kenneth. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you have actually made it to the end, I've got a big announcement as well. I have just made a Discord server for figure collectors and uh, just the co whole community, wrestling fans, figure fans, customizers. You know, we have a blast. We talk 
a lot of great subjects as well and topics in the Discord. We have fun, we just chill, and all that good stuff. And I really want to do watch-alongs with pay-per-views and everything a lot with you guys as well. So if you're interested in that, link will be in the description to go and join the Discord Storm Cloud, hosted by yours truly, Nick Storm. But yeah, anyway, I think this figure is a freaking... Uh, this figure is probably a 10 for me. Maybe a 9.5 or a 9, because the only thing that... That hurts it, I think, is the uh, the elbow joints because they just kind of scare me. I don't know. But everything else is beautiful about this figure. AW title not included. AW title sold separately. Yeah, I love the head scan. I love the hands, the posability, the updated skin tone, the attire. I love everything about it. Even though I hated it when I first saw it, it grew on me so fast. Uh, and now I like absolutely adore this figure. One of my favorite figures in my collection now, I, I, I reckon, I think. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and make sure to give it a like if you liked it and if you didn't like it, make sure to also give it a like. Comment down below if you have this figure, if you like this figure, if you hate this figure, what you like about this figure, what you hate about this figure, let me know down in the comments down below and also hit that bell, hit that subscribe button because Kenny Omega will V-trigger you into the astral plane and I don't think you want that. I, don't, I definitely don't want that but... If you don't want that, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I want to thank you guys so much, so much, so much for watching. And uh, so, yeah. Bye, bye. Whoa. V trigger to himself. Oh, my God. He sent him into the astral plane. Oh, my goodness. Australia